see things that others can't see. If otherwise, then are you curious about all the supernatural phenomena that are seemingly impossible to explain and yet dare not to check them out yourself? Welcome to Unsolved Mysteries. Tonight, come join me on a spooky journey and explore the other side. Ever wonder why the army doesn't conduct trainings on Thursday nights? Here's why. Singaporeans who have underwent military training commonly known as National Camp should be aware of this ghostly tale of Pulau Tinko, Three Door Bunk. In 1983, the recruits in Charlie Company Infantry Training Depot were preparing for their 16 km route march. It was an ordinary Thursday night about to turn into a tragic one. As per their scheduled training, marching through the forest, the scorching weather took its toll on some recruits, who gradually fall out and managed to slip away. It was only they had to do a head count when they suddenly realized one of the recruits was missing. A search party was sent out immediately. After three hours of search, finally the missing recruit was found. He was next to the tree where the company had rested earlier. He was found dead and were holding a water bottle with its cover opened. His field pack items were neatly displayed on the mud and his internal organs, intestines were ruptured and torn out forcefully and displayed audibly beside the tree in standby weapon position. But that's not all. His shovel blade found embedded inside his stomach with the handle facing in and the blade sticking out. Later, the recruit was summited at Mount Vernon with full military honors. His friends and trainers returned to the site where he died to of incense and prayers and pleaded not to come back and haunt them. After a week, it was believed that the death recruit spirit still resided in his bunk after the tragic incident. Other bunkmates experienced many hauntings and sightings. They also saw a white figure of their deceased bunkmate in front of his bed. Soon the hauntings become more intense, so they needed the service of a twist priest. Several rituals were performed by the priest, however the deceased recruit spirits can't be controlled. Finally, the priest suggested that a third door should be made. A third door was subsequently made in the middle of the bunk to release the recruit's spirit. After all these rituals, the bunk was vacated and no one ever visited anymore. Whatever was happened to him left undiscovered and will remain a mystery. We will meet you with another interesting episode. Till then, goodbye from Unsolved Mysteries. Thanks for watching.